Good everyone. So, just going to have a, a quick chat about uh, oil pressure, oil pressure gauges. Now this relates mainly to the Toyota vehicles because I mainly work on Toyota vehicles. We work on a lot of others, but this this problem is guys have a 1UZ, they put them in a surf or a Prado and they have this oil pressure gauge on the dash and they slam the motor in a hole and they don't change the oil pressure switch to the proper sensor off the old engine. So the gauge doesn't work. What happens when you've got that one and you earth it out? So I've just uh, got this set up here. Because if I earth it out, watch what happens to the gauge. I'm not getting a very good earth. Let's earth it up. There we go. So when you don't have oil pressure, it reads full oil pressure. And when you do have oil pressure, it reads nothing. So working on this present job, uh, we've just fitted a uh, link store. And I looked at solutions for it. So what I've done is into the ECU, we've configured a, an oil pressure sensor. So it's one of these ones. So what we're going to do today is we're going to remove the switch type. Screw in the sensor type. Plug the sweet sensor in. Right, with the sensor fitted, we've got the gauge hooked up to an auxiliary output. Okay, with the sensor unit, sensor, sensor connected up, we've configured uh, one of the channels to uh, the sensor. So I've done that on the auxiliary, on the analog inputs. We see here, analog volt 2, double click on the top, bring up the menu, it says oil pressure, and then we've gone into the cal calibration table and entered the calibration for that sensor. We're then going to the auxiliary outputs, and I believe I've put it on auxiliary 3 actually, we're just going to turn the tackle on for the meantime here, okay. we're going to auxiliary 3. And we're going to turn that on. We're going to just test it on PWM to start with. And if I test the PWM on, the gauge should move up. I'll just put some power on so I can control it a little bit. So if I just power up that gauge, on PWM you can see the gauge is moving up. So that's working. So we're just going to change the PWM settings. We'll put this on to GP PWM. Look down here. We have a on auxiliary three GP PWM DC. And these settings are a bit funny, so we're just going to change this. So the X is going to be um, oil pressure. And the Y I'm going to put to RPM. And we did some testing yesterday and about 3% duty cycle gave us about half a gauge. So we have an oil pressure gauge, run off the link, so that works quite nicely. So there we have it, surf pressure gauge, run off a link ECU.